Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be 10 unique baby names. I tried as best as I could to divide these into five girls and five boy names, but we'll see. Yeah, once again, I think I've kind of got seven <laughs> girl names and three boy names. And my, if you watched my fall and Halloween baby name video, you saw that um, only two were boys' names. <laughs> but before I actually get started with all these names, hit the red subscribe button down below if you've not so already have not done so already, and let's just get started. Cause oh, and like I've mentioned in my other, other videos, if these are your names or your kids' names, it's not that I don't like them. And actually, most of these I might end up using or might use. I don't know. Because I don't think it's completely up to me. <laughs> and no, I am not pregnant. These are just 10 names I absolutely love that are really unique. Okay. So. Number one is Troyan. And yes, I will put the spelling on the screen. So T O T R O I A N. And Troyan is actually the name of the actress that played Spencer on Pretty Little Liars. That's where I've heard that's where I heard this name. And it's so cute. I actually really like it and it, I think it would fit a little girl as well as an as a woman. And I don't want to name my kids something that isn't going to fit them when they're forty. Because some names you just I know a lot of people that have names that just don't fit um, adults, and I think it needs to fit the adult as well as the child. And yes, Troy is a girl name. I guess you could use it for a boy name, but I don't think it works. Okay, number two is Blaze. B-L-A-Z-E. And I'm a firefighter, so I think that's why I like this name. And I like it for a girl. But, of course, it can be used on a, on a boy, too. I think when I originally heard it, it was meant for a boy. But I like it for a girl. Okay, so number three is Linux. I actually don't remember where I heard this name. But I really like it. And, of course, the nickname could be Knox. And that's one thing. I think every one of these, well, Blaze and Troyan probably don't really have nicknames. Troy for Troyan, but I don't know what Blaze's nickname would be. But Linux has a nickname and I like that. I like names that have nicknames kind of built in. And of course you can and I like Linux for a boy. After I wrote it down, I started seeing it other places, but usually it was a last name. But I do like it for a first name. And it's totally a boy's name. It's not <laughs> I don't I couldn't see it on a girl unless it was like a punk rock chick then yeah and knowing my kid she's probably going to end up weird anyway <laughs> okay so number four is Baltimore I like this for a girl and actually this was another one of Troyan's characters on Sister Cities there were four of them and I remember Dallas and Baltimore I don't remember the other two's names, but I have a cousin named Dallas, so I couldn't do that. But I really like Baltimore. That and <laughs> I have a slight obsession with Edgar Allan Poe, so if I did Baltimore, I think it would really tie in if I did Edgar for another one of my kids. Or something along those lines. And there were more Edgar Allan Poe themed names in my Fall and Halloween baby name video. So I'll either link that down below or in one of the cards. Okay, so. The fifth one is Rika. R-Y-K-A. And this is actually a shoe brand. And I don't know why I like it. And it's, it's not I'm naming my kid after the shoes. That's just not it. I, I just like this. 
I like it as a name more than a brand name, but yeah, I think it'd be really cute on a little girl. Okay, so number six is a boy's name. It's Dax. D-A-X. And I know this is a guy on TV. I'm not really sure what he's in or anything, but, and that's not where I heard it. I heard it on a movie, I'm pretty sure, and I just kind of liked it. That, and my little brother's name is Max. And I think that's probably why I won't use it, because Dax is too close to Max. That, and it don't, it doesn't really have a nickname that goes with it. Like, I call my brother Maxer, and I don't like Daxer, and I'm guessing that's somehow what would happen. But I do like the name Dax. Okay, I don't, I just don't know if I'd use it or not. Okay, so number seven is Onyx. And this is actually what Micah Stoffer named her son. And I think I wrote this name down a week before she announced the name. And I don't, I just, I love that as a name. And I think it fits a girl and a boy, but it fits a boy a little bit better. Okay, so number seven, or no, number eight is Aspen. A-S-P-Y-N. Yeah, Y-N. Okay, apparently I like cities. <laughs> Because I'm pretty sure Aspen is a city in Colorado, but I'm spelling it different. And I like the name for a girl. I don't know, I just think it's pretty. And I think there's a YouTuber named Aspen. I'm not really sure, but I think there is. If, you're no, if you know for sure, let me know down below. <laughs> okay, and number eight, or number nine, is Americus. A M E R I C U yeah C U S. <laughs> I have my list here because the last time I did the, a name baby name video, I looked wrong and I spelled it. I didn't look and I spelled the name wrong. Mm -hmm. So this way, I've got the list and I'm spelling them right. And this is the name of the yeah the daughter on where the heart is. But I like Americas. And I don't think I'd use Nation. And I know it's technically a last name on the movie, but I I don't think I'd use it for a middle name. But I do like the name Americas. And it's really unique because you wouldn't hear it. And I'm born on July 5th, so it kind of works in, <laughs> in place in that the girl that was named Americas was supposed to be born on July 5th. No, I was not born at a Walmart. <laughs> I don't know. I like it. I don't know if I'd use it unless the baby was born around the 4th of July, though. I think that probably, I think that would, I think that would probably be the only way I would actually use this name. Okay, and the 10th and final name is Kashara. K-A-S-H-A-R-A. -A -A. And this is actually from a girl on da or a woman on Dallas Cowboys cheerleaders and she was from Kentucky and I think that ugh, spit my tongue I think that's why I like this name because it is associated with a person from Kentucky and I live in Kentucky so and I don't know if I'd use it or not like I said these are really unique baby names and while I might use some of them it's not really 100% up to me what I name my future child. Okay, so that's going to be it for this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want more baby name videos, let me know down below in the comments. And other than that, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.